Welcome to another EVS tutorial video. Today we're going to talk about how to loop a clip. I'm going to show you three ways. Let's take a look. Sometimes we need to loop a clip, perhaps for a background on an LED wall or maybe some adverts on a big screen. There are, of course, many ways to achieve your goal on an EVS XT. Here are three ways we would loop a clip. The first method is to use the loop function parameter that can be found in the operational settings menu on page 9.3. Here you can select either loop or loop clip bounce. The first option will just play the clip again and again with a hard cut between them. The second option, loop clip bounce, will play the clip, bouncing back and forth between the short in and out of the clip. Recall the clip, activate the loop function and press play. The second method is to put the clip in a playlist and activate playlist loop in your operational setup menu on page 3.2. This way you can define an incoming transition to that clip so that you can have a mix or wipe. By the way, you'll see an L on your multi-viewer to denote that the loop function is activated. Bear in mind that now this function is on, it will loop any playlist that you select. The VDR panel can also be used to loop a clip. Bring up the VDR panel by hitting Shift and F9 on the VGA. Now hit Control plus F1 and take control of the channel you require. With Alt and H you can choose the channel on the server that you want to control. Load the clip by using the VGA screen at the bottom half of the VDR screen. You can now hit Alt and Y to loop the clip. We can do the same for the second channel. You'll continue to loop until you hit record again on your LSM remote.